Okay, so we're going to work out the perimeter of a circle. Uh, the formula that we use, there's two ways it's presented. It's either uh, presented to you as something like this, 2 pi r, or it's presented to you as pi d. They both mean exactly the same. So perimeter equals either pi, 2 pi r or pi d. What I mean by that is that it's 2 times radius times pi. Well, 2 times radius is exactly the same as diameter. Okay? So some people remember it this way. I do. Um, some people remember it that way. That's absolutely fine. Okay? The radius of this particular circle is 12 centimetres because the diameter is 24. Okay, so to work out the perimeter... I would work it out as 2 times pi, which is given to you on your exam sheet, usually a value of 3.142, multiplied by the radius, which is 12. So 2 times pi times 12, using my calculator, uh, which I did a little bit earlier on, is 7508 centimetres. So, so two decimal places, that would be 75.41 centimetres. So what we've done is worked out the distance of the perimeter, which is all the way around this circle. So it's a little fella running around. Now, some people call it perimeter. Uh, the proper name for it is circumference. It's the circumference of the circle, but nevertheless, perimeter is absolutely fine. Uh, there's two formulas. They both will give you exactly the same answer, and on this particular circle, it's 75.41 centimetres to two decimal places. Um, if you have a look at uh, mathswrap.co.uk, uh, there are some learning sheets you'll be able to download and have a little play and uh, see if you can work out the perimeter strong circumference. Maybe try these two separate formulas and satisfy yourself that they will both give you the same answer. That's it, babe. I did, yeah.